morning. Look at my daffodils. Brighten up your Monday or Sunday whenever you're watching this. How pretty are they? Um, this is the fit. Boohoo, Missy Empire, H&M, H&M, Boohoo socks. Um, I've decided I'm going to have to stop wearing my glasses again. And I don't know if they suit me. It's going to be really dark because it's raining outside. I don't know how I feel. I don't know if I look a bit weird. What do you think? Um, I don't wear them often. I bought them last year because I needed them and then I haven't worn them for a year and a half. So, yeah, I need to hurry up. Shit, I need to leave. I'm gonna make myself some yogurt and yeah, I'll speak to you when I come back for lunch. <laughs> Dark, but I'm meant to be going back to work but I just wanted to quickly show you this package from Goose and Gander I could cry when I opened it look at this it's got in like a little quote which is the inspiration behind the edit a key ring a cookie a cookie from the cake box I could scream and then they've sent me their new hoodie it's their new spring one. It's got, I've got all little like, of the little pom pom things everywhere. I They sent me like a brief of what I want, in, uh, not a brief, like a, a mood board of which one I wanted. And I genuinely love them all that much. I was like, can you just send me a surprise colour? And I just asked for the biggest, the biggest one. Honestly, this is so soft, this fur. This is really good quality. I can't wait to wear this. I might wear it tomorrow. And it'll be nice in summer with some um, cycling shorts. It says, Designer Maze. It was inspired by the season of spring, which marks the return of the sun, bringing with it brighter and warmer weather. Spring officially begins on, bega begins on Sunday, 20th of March, marking the spring equinox. The spring equinox is when the sun crosses the equator in the northern hemisphere to bring equal periods of day and night. We see flowers begin to bloom and trees blossom across the country. Cherry blossoms are a symbolic flower of spring. A time of renewal and the fleeting nature of life. That's so cute. So yeah, I'm going to leave that there and then I'm going to try this on for you. Um, I'm going back to work because I'm late, so I will catch up with you. We're going to Primark now, so I'll see you in a bit. Love you. Okay, guys, so the cookie, I'll, look how dark it is. The cookie I showed you earlier. Piss me off. And, <laughs> me and Dan and Rory apparently are going to eat some. He's oh, had oh. nearly a whole pack of meat. He, he, doesn't, meat. he doesn't eat cookies. We don't give him shit like this, so just put that on record. Oh yeah, no, but he, he likes to sniff everything we it's touch. Very nice. We would never eat, feed him a cook. Right? Mmm. That's soft. <laughs> it's very soft. I thought it was going to be a biscuit. Mm, no, it's very soft. It's gorgeous. You're breathing so heavy. Come on. Poor dog who doesn't get fed. <laughs> he had a carrot earlier which he just didn't eat. And he has got food and water. You being greedy. Just staring at me. Cookie. Fair enough. Is it just um, prime what you go? Yeah. Can, you can make people happy by getting their heating on and working. Aww. Yeah, well, I thought we'd be going to keep one in. <laughs> Hello everybody, so I'm now with my angel, we're just approaching into Birmingham I'm just um, applying my uglay Here she is, Shameless plug. look at that beautiful angel no there liner. with her gloss Look at that, stunning, <laughs> absolutely stunning So I think we've both got the same shade on actually today I like this one I feel like it's what my lips would look like yeah, just with your lips but better. Yeah, my lips but better. I've got a um, my cap on today, but I'm a bit worried about my ears poking out. So sorry if you can see that. I'm trying to. <laughs> um. So yeah, what outfit are you wearing today? Oh, let's um, show you nails. Oh yeah, just had my nails just... done. Wow, blue queen. We w had a conversation over text because I was like, get the more darker colours out of the way for the new system. Know. 
and she did have a different inspo picture but that's okay these remind me of west brom like i feel like i'm really vibing with the west brom <laughs> okay <laughs> <laughs> but um, my outfit is primark bodysuit which i got last time i think this is miss pack or miss it's got a green one out and it's really nice okay. yeah and then i've got plt joggers um leggings on they do rip easy don't they oh they're awful they do go so like being in the um dishwasher Oh, the tumble dryer. dryer. <laughs> I'll just put them in the dishwasher with no, the plates. Them in the dishwasher. Really cleans them. I only um, air dry them. Um, I've still got on half the same outfit as this morning, but I've put on my denim jacket and my bag and um, then my cap. And what I was going to say, I'm hoping Primark will actually have the set. Where is the cap from? Missy Empire. Yeah. And I've got the grey one too. Missy Club. Looks nice, nice shape. It is a nice shape, isn't it? Although sometimes it does look a little bit boxy, but I think I haven't got it tight enough on my head. But it's not the one you know where it has the look. Yeah, it's, it's a, yeah, it's quite the right size. Um, so yeah, I just thought I'd let you know we're coming into Birmingham. Do you know what? I would really like some kind of beverage. I knew you were going to say that. Would you? I'm yeah, slagging. I'm very what. tired. What beverage could we have? We could have a bubble tea. We could have a boost. I've never had a boost, but are oh, they yeah. thick to drink? There's a boost there. Oh no, is this Ollie's mango one yeah, for the vlog? You can, that one's a smoothie, but they do juice, which is nice. Like, you can get a green juice, which is a bit more of me, but on that, when I was vlogging, they said no juices. Why? So I said, I don't want one then, thank you. I threw my dummy out of the pram, to be honest. Um, so, I, I'm open to getting, maybe not a thick juice, so a thick smoothie, so Good I'm open juice. to either... Bubble tea? A, a bubble tea or a Starbucks. Yeah. Either. Yeah, what would you prefer? Do you prefer? Do you prefer something more refreshing like a bubble tea? Or would you prefer like uh, a coffee or? I'll an leave hot that chocolate? one up to you because I'd have the iced hot chocolate. Oh, so it's really up to you. <laughs> well, we haven't had a bubble tea in a while, but sometimes they do get a bit sickly, don't they? I know. But then, and I would. I think. What's the flavour like? The lychee one. Do you have one? What do you have? So. Lychee and peach. Mm, that nice. I've only ever had strawberry. Uh, with strawberry bubbles or mango with strawberry bubbles. Yeah, I think I've had lychee. Really? Is it nice? Yeah, I like lychees, those little lychees you get. I've never bit. tried lychee before. They're yum. Are they? Mm. Are they chewy? No, it's like a bubble tea. When we had them, I was like, oh, I've never had a lychee before, and it's just like a bubble tea. Oh. Like, a bit like a pear, but a bit like a bubble tea. I don't know, it's strange. Mm, that sounds interesting. One of, a, one of a kind. Oh, I don't know then, so it's either... I've got an idea. Okay. Okay. So, okay. So you be bubble tea and I'll be Starbucks, and whoever wins rock paper scissors will choose. I'm bubble tea. Actually, and shall I be Starbucks? Yes. Okay, ready. Rock, rock paper, paper scissors. scissors. Oh, rock, rock paper, paper scissors. scissors. Oh, I want to make sure you do the best out of it. Okay. <laughs> you want the bubble tea then? I don't know what. I want. <laughs> okay. Rock, rock paper, paper scissors. scissors. Oh, I don't know what I want though. Okay, I've got another go. <laughs> okay. In one of your hands, yeah. pick one for Starbucks and one for Fink, and then I'll guess left or right. Okay. Okay? Yeah. I've guess. guessed. I'm, I've decided. Left. Starbucks. Oh, really? Yeah, really. Is, is it a sign? It's what should we sign. get? I'm what gonna are you going to get? Iced hot chocolate. Two pumps of white chocolate. I think I may have... That matches my eight for anyway. I wonder if we could be bothered to get a picture. I know. Again. I did think about taking a picture, but then I realised I put this cardigan on. I don't know how it would look in a picture. You could put this on. Yeah. If you wanted to. Don't worry. Always yeah. there to help. Hey, Angels, we're in the lift. I'm tired. We've, got, we've secured a bag. And we're off. Huh? The new Primark. Oh my god, we've got fun stuff. We're just walking back now. Pull up to the camera. Did you? I hope. Why does it look locked, Jode? The lights are off. Oh, yeah. There's a going in. I'm, yeah. I'm proud of my battery for lasting so long. Oh, it was order. Oh. <laughs> in she goes. I'll get it. Thank you. Look at this sugar mummy vibes. <laughs> now, I need to pay for a Primark. <laughs> a £1.50 scar. Really today. I really have. Working nine till five, guys. Okay. <laughs> I can really treat the unworking. <laughs> Hermes have lost four of my glass orders. That's a hundred pound I've had to compensate for. I've sent them a very nasty email. Yeah, it's yeah. it's my money. It's my business here if that you've eaten got into. Proof. <laughs> I can't get you now. <laughs> if you've got proof. 
If you've got proof that you've sent them, they should surely Yeah, we have. I've got a tracking number to prove it, bitches. And it says on the thing when you buy them up to £25 insurance. Well, so I expect, but trying to get hold of the bastards. Yeah, that's the problem, isn't it? Actually getting mm -hmm. a human, like not a computer. Um, but where should we go on the couple's holiday? This is to be discussed, guys. <laughs> oh, um, what was I going to say to you? Um, so, what have you got any ideas? Mm, not really. I haven't really thought about it. I mean, the places where we can go is really going to be Greece, Cyprus. Yeah. I think there's... So, say bye to Joe. I'm sure you'll see her one day this week. On Wednesday. On Wednesday. Bye, guys. Bye. Okay, guys. I've just got home from Primark. I was earlier than Dan expected, so go me. Um, I've, I've, there's literally a clip pretty much identical to this that's just gone up in my other vlog. And Dan was cooking with his top off like that and he went god my back looks good so more back action for you if you think it looks good too i did actually just do back so. did you um i've had a i had a hat on so if ignore my hair dan just really laughed at my head you laughed at yourself mate yeah you're not bullying me but i've got this to try dr pepper cream soda and dan's got a fanta peach let's test it Do you know what this tastes like? It's the smaller one. <laughs> you have, have you put all the sausages in? Yeah. Chop, uh, chop, take a couple off a month. No, it's fine. No, I take a couple off a month, aren't you? have got, you haven't got those. It's all right. Um, oh, I like the look of this pasta. Fat. Uh, there's two different ones. Oh, we really mixed it up. Well, there wasn't enough of the old one, so um, I chopped a couple. Of them. So this tastes like. And not as intense. I feel like you might like that. He doesn't love cream soda. Uh, Dr Pepper or cream soda, but for a try. Can you piss off, please? Damn, darling, your sausage isn't ready. Ugh, hate that. Really? Hate that. Hate. You, do you know what? You find this with the least fussy people, really weird things trigger them. Yeah, that taste like our, is my least favourite. One taste. of our family members, Daz, he eats anything and everything, it's like a rubbish bin. However, he hates celery, hates it, which is just so weird. Can I? Yeah. I reckon it'd be banging. Tastes a bit just like the a fizzy peach iced tea. Oh, it was like. You try. Yeah, that's the shit. Well, we've got our usual mundane night meal. Yeah, it is to be fair. Spinach. Chicken sausages, pasta, bit of cheese, salt, perfect. Tomato mascarpone sauce. But I'm going to go and chill now because I feel like I've filmed all day and edited all day. So, bye bye. See you tomorrow. One, two, three. Fuck it. My darling, I love you, 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 what it is um i don't know if it's like bruised or like strained but if any of you have ever had it please can you tell me if it lasts i'm tempted to ring the opticians and just get my eyes checked um but i'm just feeling very oh, i don't know i'm just struggling with my energy i just feel wiped i'm not sure why um so yeah that's the story my makeup looks rubbish today um, I've got this collusion jumper on from ASOS, just some black couch and leggings, some boohoo man socks and then I had my uggies on and then my green bomber jacket but I just wanted to say, sorry for the movement, I just wanted to say hello, um, I'm a tight queen, um, I might have a coffee or do I have one at 
Do I have a coffee now or do I have one at work? I don't know. I'm feeling a bit I'm going to try and make it to the gym. I don't, like, I don't know whether I'm just in a funk and that's why I don't have energy or I genuinely don't have energy, you know? I don't know. I might make a coffee, actually. I might use Dan's mug with my little baby on it. That's what I got him for his birthday. Me and Mum love you so much, Dad. I'm trying to do like making coffee and putting the milk in first and then stirring and then filling it up, see if that works. I got told apparently that's better, so we'll see. Also, I'm really close to hitting 60k on TikTok, how fun. TikTok! 60k? Like, if that was a, like, in real life, that would be mad, wouldn't it? I'm so glad I went um I uploaded a TikTok last night. No, the night before. Um, and it's got 700k, which is just crazy. Like, 700,000 people, that's like a town, right? Is it? I'm not very good at things like this, so don't quote me on that. Um... So yeah, I just think it's crazy, like, if that, you had that many people in front of you and you were actually making the TikTok, wouldn't that be mad? Hang on, I'm just going in the living room and you'll be able to see better. I bet you're all real being messy. Any money? Shock. Hi, Mummy C! Should I ring now? Oh, I ring any people, it gives me anxiety. Hi, you. I was just ringing. Um, if I could possibly book an eye test with you, I haven't been to you before. Let's have a look. Uh, do you know what really fuck up? Like, this thing work anyway. Oh. Joy. There we are. Thank um, you. Well, I don't know you want this. Is your miss? Uh, miss. Um, your date of birth, please. Uh, the 19th of July. Uh, so, yep. 1999. Nearly. <laughs> Lovely. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Bye See you Friday. Friday. Bye. Bye. What a lovely man. Rory's like ripping up the basket behind me. Hello. Do you want me to help you? What toy are you looking for? Can I help you in any way, sir? Ripping up the basket. My favourite. Mr. Mole's my best <laughs> friend. Drink my coffee. How do you know when I'm getting up? One more throw then. Ready? Drop. Oh, he's so cute. Yes, he is. He's a cutie. So, um, I'm not going to go to the gym because I just feel... I just don't feel right. Um, I just feel a bit drained. So I'm not going to go, I'm just going to have a bath and do my tan and just have a bit of a self care evening. Um, but I just want, I literally got two things but I just wanted to show you what I picked up from Primark. First things first, which like literally just made me want to cry as a holiday. You could literally almost just get this as a top. But what we actually, me and Joe got matching, what I actually wanted it for was to do the I mean I've got a bunny but imagine if your hair was down and um your hair was really wavy you know beach vibes so bought this but this right now and then I literally picked up this oversized jumper which yeah I do have a few but that's not the point I really liked the vibe I picked it up in an XL and it was £10 and this is what it's on it I haven't even looked at it properly Parasadina racket academy but i just really liked the colors like it's a nice everyday jumper and i hope it'll be nice and big so yeah i just thought this was really really cool and for 10 pounds you can't really go wrong can you so that's all i picked up and it was literally my total i, picked, I bought jody's little scarf as well um so my whole thing comes in at 13 pound which is record 
in Primark. But I've got a bath running and I might try the new TikTok. I bought this off TikTok shop. In one Dyson Air Wrap dupe. So I'm going to test that later so I'll show you. But for now, I'm going to take my makeup off, jump in the bath, scrub my tan off, re tan. That's what we like. The next room, do you have any ready? I'll check. Oh guys, it's our dinner time and we're going to have these Fantas. I can't remember which one we like more. I've got a feeling it's the berry. I think, I think it's the berry. Mm. 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 That's so good. <laughs> it was the berry, wasn't it? It's got the strawberry. I think the strawberry was very, very sweet. both amazing oh, yeah. mm. okay i'm gonna try out oh, i don't know if i'm sure i'm gonna regret this i kind of want to try the new aqua tanning mousse by uh, makeup revolution <clears throat> i'm low-key a little bit worried about it because it's clear should we sniff it i'm a bit concerned i can't lie Oh my god, it smells amazing. Oh dear. I'm a little bit worried. Right, let me just put you on more more toilet roll to make sure there's no slippages. Let's just do it. Fuck it. Just stay and practice as normal here. We've got this before. Morning, happy Wednesday. So Today I've got work and then I'm going straight to my lash lift and teen appointment. It's in about it's about 25 minutes, half an hour. And the tan turned out awful by the way, it's rubbish. It's so I mean not if you like a medium tan, but if you like a medium tan, get the ultra dark because I'm just such a light colour, so I'm gonna redo it tonight. Um was an ambulance. Um but I'm going to drive and like, do an assumptions video on the way there and then on the way back I'm going to do a thing with me so you will have me still, I've got two batteries with me and I'm going to clear some memory card space um, so I don't, I'm going to go and take Rory at uh, what time? I'm going to go and take Rory to the hairdressers at literally quarter to nine, it's five to eight um, which is a bit inconvenient because I look like I'm going to work then <laughs> coming straight back but it is what it is Dan can't take him because he's in London so um, yeah that's the vibe for today um, I feel a bit I'm just, I really don't want to go to work I'm struggling this morning like I got up and I just, you know you have to like stop yourself when Dan said bye I thought god I could just sit and cry not, not cute oh there's no to fucking park in this stupid place pisses me off I've got a new jumper on for a product, but I don't know if I like it. I feel like it's not big enough for an extra large, you know? Oh my god, it's raining. Oh, guys, it's got all my batteries on low, for God's sake. That's so annoying. I'm going to get my little muffin. My little baby, the camera's on low battery, so if you die, I'm sorry. I've got two of us at work. Um... Let's put some music on, I'm in a bad mood, so let's cheer ourselves up, hey? I'm an idiot. Why am I doing that when the car's not on? I haven't even got a lash lift appointment. So I just messaged the girl, looked on my text, my last lift appointment is not next till next week so I'm going to go and get a costa and I'm going to film an assumptions video because I had loads of assumptions. So I'm going to do that now um, and yeah I mean it's a bit dark but we'll try and find a good light at costa. I'm an absolute idiot, like I've got no mascara and I look a bit like a rat but we're going to go for the, 
I say natural, natural vibe. <laughs> Not really natural when I've got a face full of makeup. Um, I've been starting to wear a bit of, well, I think it, whether it's because I'm running out of my flawless filter, but I don't feel like my um, tan, no, my make, like, makeup is covering my skin very well at the minute. So I've been putting a bit of Urban Dream cover on by Maybelline, and do you know what? I'm absolutely loving it. I really enjoy that. Such a good foundation because it's not very matte, not very. I don't know what it is, but like it just really looks nice on the skin. Doesn't go patchy, like it's just a go-to. And obviously, it's not expensive. It's Maybelline, so I just feel like it's an all-round winner. Um, but I just thought I'd drop on and say hello before I film this assumption video. I'm a little bit nervous. I feel a bit sick. I think it's because like. You ask for these assumptions and then people assume things and you think, God, do people think that? <laughs> and I know you can't do ask for it and a lot of the time I don't really care, but when I'm going to have to openly speak about it, I know I could choose not to, but I feel like it's the point of the video. Like, it's good to get them in the air so people don't ask or keep assuming, right? Um, so I'm a little bit scared. I feel like sometimes I can come off as a bit like, I don't care. But obviously I do care. We do have feelings. I just, I think if you protect, like... I. With my don't care attitude, I feel like I, it's a bit of a fake it till you make it. Like a lot, some things I just don't care about. I just think whatever. But some things do bother me. Like, like I've had a couple of comments to do with my weight and stuff on TikTok, it's just, and it's weird how like you can get these lovely comments like, "Oh, you look amazing," blah blah blah, and then you get a comment saying like, "I, I, rem I put a TikTok about it. You, some some of you might have seen it, and it was about my PLT corset that I really like." And this girl commented, which I am a size 12, but I got it in a size 10 because I, of course, I size down. And like, I'm like a 10, 12 up top. And the girl was like, you're at least a 16. Um, and size 12 is definitely not curvy. And like, I just thought, who do you think you are for a start? But I've got to remember people are, are quite close minded, aren't they? Like not everyone has an open mind. And also I don't like that when people say like, size 12 isn't curvy. Curvy's a V is a body type not a size do you know what I mean like how can you just discriminate like that so like that comment did stick with me a bit and I thought mm, do I look like a size 16 not that there's anything wrong with that but obviously I'm not so meaning do I look that much bigger than I am but then I'm like who cares what that girl and her number plate was like bitch like, do I care what she thinks probably not it's just when someone tells you something negative that maybe that you are a bit insecure about aka my weight I suppose it does hit a little bit um so that's just me being a little bit honest um I'm fine about it I'm not upset I just got to start with me I thought hmm interesting interesting um I need to get my car service so bad I think I say this in every vlog am I gonna do it probably not um this is my you make me no you are magic such a nice nude I was using this pound prime, um, lip liner from Primark, which is quite nice actually. Not bad. It's one pound and it's in the shade Toast. Oh, I like that. I'm kind of enjoying it, you know. I feel like it's not very long lasting, but what do you, I don't think any lip liner is, to be honest. I've never found one that I'm like. God, that's incredible. I've got, uh, actually, Rimmel's is okay, like the cappuccino. I do like that, but I think that's because it's so dark and obviously I dig lip lime a bit over my lips. So I feel like it does last longer because it's on the skin rather than the lips. Because like, I'm not, when I'm eating, it's not. So God, I am rambling on. Oh, God, this is probably so boring for you guys. I don't know what to get from. I was going to go to Starbucks, but I don't want a coffee. I've got a really bad headache. So I think I might go to Costa. Costa! So I think I'm going to get a peach iced tea. Um, I think. Do I want anything else? Or do I have a decaf iced coffee? Where's that noise coming from? And Beyonce. How do, can you tell the difference between an ambulance and a police car? I feel like you can't. No, obviously to see, but I meant the siren. I don't know. I need to look where the light is so I can make sure I'm not backlit them. Oh. It's so nice to be free without Rory. Like, I feel like a free mum, like my, my kids being baby, so. What do I get? This is a lot of pressure, isn't it? And you can tell everybody that this is a song. What do I want? Frostino. Ice. I'm 
might be. Hi, can I get a medium peach iced tea, please? Yeah, of course. Do you have any? Um, do you have any like strawberry syrup or anything? Yeah, we have strawberry syrup. Could I have um, a couple of pumps of that in the peach iced tea, please? Yeah, that's fine. Anything else? No, thank you. Okay, let's go for me. Greatness. Back room for God's sake. Let's get one. <clears throat> I think they're in here. She don't want to phone because I'm the one. Okay, I've got one, two. One of these is going to be dead. Factory roulette, what do you reckon? I reckon you're full. I was right. I remember because that one's got like a, like a bit coming off. No one cares about my battery that's full. Good morning, happy Thursday. I feel like it should be Friday by now. Um, here's a fit, very chill. Boo-hoo, boo-hoo, misguided, hitching out. Dehitchgate. My mum, my mum's so disgusting. She's, we've got like a family group message and she's put, Morning, Pebbles has gone out for a wee and come back with a slug attached to it. It's my mum's dog. Who cares? Because what should we have? I've been enjoying these guys. And I've been waiting for these next wings to be ripe for what feels like years. Oh, we're getting somewhere there's a squish. I've been really enjoying my orange in the morning too. They're not the like nicest oranges. They're a bit, a bit on the, the mouldy side, but that's okay. We're all about health here. You don't want to... I had this for brekkie yesterday. And I really enjoyed it. I didn't have one carb yesterday. I was freaking starving. Skrr. Chocolate and nuts. Um, I haven't shown you Rory after his haircut, have I? Let's show you the little beast. I've, got an, I've really been having a break off earrings, which has been really nice. My hair is greasy. And I did try the Dyson... I'm not focus. I did try the Dyson Air Wrap yesterday, but... It's the fake one off TikTok shop, but I just need a bit more work, I think. I'm not sure. Let's go and see Rory. Keys. Mobile device. Let's go off. Let's see the little scam. Betty's on the chair. <laughs> Hello, could you show people what you look like after your haircut? Could you do a twirl? Could you say, here I am? God, you look miserable today, don't you, whoops? You're tired. Such a shame for you, isn't it? We've got to go to work, eh? them legs moving. Do you yawn? Oh, sometimes. Oh. Look at that grumpy little face. Look at that grumpy little face. I wish I'd have vlogged when I got him guys because he was so cute. You're my best friend. He looks so cute doesn't he after his haircut. Have you been to get your haircut? Say yes, mummy. You're so cute. Should we go to work? Should we go to work? Brown eyes. We've got brown eyes together. Kiss me. No, mum. Woo! Katy Perry and Orlando Bloom putting the house up for sale. 19.5 mil. 
She's a beauty. Nineteen million. Wow. Look at that. That's crazy. And then look at this dog. Imagine brushing that. You'd be there hours. You really would. We bought him um, a replacement of his favourite toy, Dean. And he's really enjoying it, aren't you? Is that Dean? Have we missed Dean in our life? This is where he got his nickname, Rory Dean, because he was obsessed with this when he was younger. And we left it in Ealing last year at the England final. Should we take it with us to work? Say bye, see you in a minute, Dean. Okay. <laughs> if you don't like dogs, I can imagine you really find this these bits boring, but a bit of Rory Cam doesn't hurt anyone when he's so cute. Right, I'm going to put it in Mummy's bag now, so say, say see you in a minute. <laughs> I have just got home for lunch. For an hour walk, you ready to see my boss? Throwing skills. Ready, Rob? What's this? Woo! Guys, we're having a competition. <laughs> <laughs> Who can throw the ball the furthest? Stands is over there. It's a nine My turn. Yeah, you can go from the red one. He just hit me. It's a serious one. This is no way possible to me. It so is. Yeah, if you want. Second attempt. I'm making Dan go a bit further back because I'm not very good. Go Let's see how he gets on. Raw, that's Mummy's ball. <laughs> Off he goes. Oh, crap. That's that was really good. Crap. Swap. And then on the podium. Shut up. Did I shut up? Yeah. What? Well, well, fuck's sake. It was by that brown bit of dirt. Yeah. <laughs> I reckon it beat. It did beat. True or not? Just, I was from back then. <laughs> and squalene. Squalene's meant to be really good for acne actually. And then, oh, I hate that noise. And then I got, it's a Bondi Babe Purifying Clay Mask. Purifying Clay Mask with blue spirulina extract. So let's have a look what they look like. Oh, they're really cute. They're really nice. I feel like they'd look really cute on this the um, side. I feel like they have a very nice, um, like the, their packaging is really cute. I feel like this is good marketing because that makes me think, ah. Oh. So yeah, that's all the vibe for today. Um, I'm going to edit my vlog. Not my vlog, an assumptions video. So that will already be up. So if you haven't watched it, go and watch it. Um, it's kind of a Kind of spilling the whole of my life, which is a bit scary, a bit nervous to upload it, but it's a video and it's the truth, so that's okay. 
Um, so that's all I kind of have to update you. I'm so happy it's Friday tomorrow. I'm so hungry. We've got back from our walk. Go on, who says? And I'm gonna put a hair magazine. This isn't gonna be tall enough, I don't think, for you. I'm using Maui. I'm just gonna shove it on and then leave it for an hour or so and then we have a shower and then I'm gonna retan tonight because I didn't really like that makeup revolution one it just wasn't dark enough for me to be honest it's moisturize the old hairy I'm gonna wash it tonight and then try the air wrap I think and we can dry it properly together together forever my Uglo orders so I just thought I'd show you like a BTS so for this girl she ordered you make moves and you are magic so they're about two nude one's more pinky one's more brown how cute so yeah I'm gonna go and put you on a time lapse and I'm gonna pack the rest of the orders I've got a stamp that says Made with love by Uglo. So I just test that on the paper. So then I get the stamp. One, two, three, four. Made with love by Uglo. So that's all done, and then I'm going to do the rest. isn't it oh, whatever who cares how boring let's turn that on it's freezing i had to defrost the screen this morning guys not cute but good morning i was watching a video last night by someone called mel robbins and if you don't know her get to know she's if you're into manifesting like be more positive um not letting worry not letting worry get to you blah 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 just living a more positive life no. then she's really good oh I just got him on oh, come on can't go a bit faster um oh shit I've got no petrol good luck trying to find that um yeah so she's really good and she has a youtube channel she has a podcast like she's been on loads of people's podcasts she's been on Stephen Bartlett's podcast she's really good and she said every morning like when people say they're manifesting they're not really manifesting and how she described it was with the lid off and what she meant by that was basically like you're not manifesting like to the like imagination that y you like can like she was like every morning with five every morning whenever it is or every day write five things down that you want she's like said like whether it's your dog not to bark whether it's to go and get a meal deal whether it's to win the lottery whether it's to you know five things like today i want to meet meet jody for a coffee i want to get a takeaway with dan i want to 
have a positive day, I want to leave work on time, I want to manage to walk Rory. So then you set in intentions and it doesn't have to be the same thing every day, it can be, it doesn't have to be. She like said there's no like set rules. But I just found it really interesting. I thought but she was like and then she was saying like you a lot of people like with their vision boards, which I've got a vision board, you just put the end goal like whereas you're always gonna have one motivation because you haven't got like the only thing on your vision board is that beach house. But obviously you haven't got that yet and it's gonna be a while before you get that. And I, just, I haven't watched the full thing yet, it's two hours. I only got about 20 minutes in while we were having a snack last night. Um, but I just thought I'd tell you guys um, if you were interested. So I'm gonna watch the full thing and just see what my verdict is. Um, I thought it was interesting. Um, because it basically like, we're not manifesting to the full extent with the lid off she described it. And I assume like she was like, a lot of you wouldn't, if you wanted to have a book and you wanted it to be the New York bestseller, like a lot of people wouldn't even write it down because they didn't believe it was possible and like you're already that's where the doubt started and it's so true like I like would want to be I'd be nervous writing say I want to be the first female millionaire in my family and, it, and I suppose because you think is it possible but I suppose if you don't even believe it's possible why would it be um, very deep chat for 9 o'clock on a Friday morning but anyway so I just thought I'd tell you guys because I thought it was interesting um, I've been in a bit of a weird headspace this week. I've been a bit down. I think I've just been a bit stressed and a bit emotional. So that's why I've been a bit rubbish on the talking front. So I hope that, sorry for not being very chatty with you guys. Um, tomorrow I'm going to the Arsenal um, with my dad. So I'll be all there all Saturday. I'll vlog what I can. Um, and I'm gonna, whether it'll be up on Sunday or not, I'm gonna try my best. But um, today I'm probably gonna meet Jodie for a coffee for lunch and then meet Joe for a coffee um, I've got my eyebrow appointment I forgot about that and we're gonna go and get our toes done straight after work because I usually finish around well I'm gonna try and finish at half three today um, and then we're gonna try and go and get our toes done then I'm gonna go and get my brows down so a bit down done so a bit of a pamper today which is nice I'm gonna do my tan tonight so we'll have a nice evening together I've also had a very exciting Instagram message this company you can't even see me I'm so sorry this company messaged me and was like um, like we've got like branches all over the um all over like the not the country yeah maybe the country i don't know um and they were like um could we give you a voucher and you'd like write your food on tiktok i was like oh my god any day yes yes and yes so they sent me a voucher and it was for like one main meal and two drinks so i'll buy dan like the rest of his meal and we'll make a tiktok about it so that's so fun so i'll put you i'll bring you with us to t tell you like an honest review of the food and stuff the nearest one to warsaw which is about 20 minutes away um have i got anything else to say um i haven't made it to the gym again but this is the f oh i've got the opticians in an hour that this is the first morning i have and yesterday that i haven't woken up with a massive headache and a pain in my eye so i think it came from stress to be honest um as well as a bit of covid so i feel a little bit better today which is really nice i'm really happy about that um so i'm going to go to my eye test that i'll speak to you on the way at 20 to 11 and it's currently 906 so i'm gonna go there i think i need my glasses changing to be honest i've started to wear them recently but i, I still like feel like i've got a lot of strain on my eyes so see what they say about that and that is all i have to say this morning i'm pretty much nearly at the breakfast we're back i haven't got much i've only got 19 minutes footage left I'm feeling, do you know what, this song, I really enjoy this song, it's a bit sad so I don't feel like you'll all love it that much. You, there's no forever baby, take whatever's left of me, if you go without your heart you will never know. There were moments when you fall to the ground But you were stronger than you feel you are now You don't always have to speak so loud No, just be as you are Stop making me out of me I'm so making me out of you Don't let me tell you Maybe it's a real one that night You will put up and down So I don't know what you're looking for So I don't know what you're looking for One 
Barcelona, I still long to hold her once more. On the way to the opticians, guys, um, which is not really fun. I haven't been to the opticians in over a year, so I'm a little vulnerable. To be honest, I'm a so we're going there and I'm going to park, oh, I don't really know where to park because I'm still a little bit new around here so I think I might park in Morrison's and then go on sweetie. Uh, we'll see you then. Okay, just wait a um, So yeah, I'm going to park there, go to the opticians, my camera battery's going to die. I don't know if I picked up the other two that I charged, they're fully charged though which is a beautiful feeling, oh no, sorry, an accident. Excuse me, thank you. Um, High School Musical has been living in my head rent free at the moment since we watched it last week. And how I'm obsessed with the new Jack Carlo song, let's put it on. It's so good. Hello, I'm gonna dive off. Just got to lunch with Joe. Um, we're on our weekly date. Rory's joined us today. He's joined Girls' Day. Um, we've got some chicken and bacon pasta. This is like our little tradition now. <laughs> Somehow I got the steeper end of the deal and get the coffee. <laughs> the little monkey. Um, so I got an iced caramel. Joe got an iced hot choc. They understand the assignment here, unlike the woman in Birmingham. Absolutely. She did not get that. Well, that's so nice. So, and then we got chicken and bacon, and Joe got a prawn and some watermelon. Rory, Rory will share our dindins. Oh, yeah, and Joe bought some watermelon. So, we're going to tuck in, guys. Come on. 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 Come on.
My phone's gonna die. I don't wanna put my engine on and I don't wanna draw attention to the fact that I'm the only one in this stupid car park. Oh, what do I do? I've sent Dad to come and get me. I'm freezing as well, but I don't wanna put the engine on. I don't know what I'm gonna do. What if I'm stuck here all night? I might have to just leave my car here. What if I get fined? Hello? Hello. You right? Yeah, I'm stressed. You are? I'm stressed. What if I get fined? I'm more worried about getting the car out of the car park than the fight, to be honest, babe. Well, you said you can grind it down. Well, yeah, I'll grind, I'll, I'll grind the lock if I have to. I'm fucking leaving you locked in a car park, am I? <laughs> <laughs> I'll buy him a new fucking... I'll add it, add, it, add it to the fucking bill if they want. I'll buy him a fucking new lock as well. Oh, my God, this is so... I, c I can't go back in. How embarrassing. I don't want to go into the salon. Did you ring the number? Yeah, no, but I, I think it's... When you come, um, when you come, you can see me, and but just park in the beauty car park next to it, like, that's open. Where are you two? Well... Um, I, oh god, I'm, I'm so embarrassed, I could cry. I am, are we locked in a car park? Dan's going to help me. There he is, my, my not in shining armour. What has mommy done? Mommy's so silly, Raw. Look at his paw. Why do I literally look crazy? When you get your brows done, you always look so crazy. I honestly you just had the loveliest girl. Who did my brows? She, brow. she was so nice. She made me feel so comfortable. Dan looks angry. Oh no. What do you think's the best method? Well, they're not answering, are they? Do you want to ask in there if they know who owns it or not? Not really, because I'm not going in there. Okay. Uh, let's try AZ. Really. Well, he's freezing. I've just put the heat on. Dan's on the way now. He's got his grinder. Hello, we're back. Rory Town. Cheeseburger, extra gherkins, nine nuggies. Oh, they smell salty. Chippies. Just seeing whose chips are muffled. Don't put them all in your pot, they're mine. Dan, this is why I don't let you do it, you're so greedy. This burger feels cold, feel that? We're gonna munch. Fake tan complete. I've got my cute little everyday skincare from Bondi. I've got the tan on. Much darker, much better. Is it on? So yeah, I look disgusting. So I'm gonna go to bed and I'll wake up in the morning and see you. I'm going to brush it out now. Um, I have got a couple of straight bits, but that's okay. I've got a lot of hair. I'm just going to try and make a tiktok -y about it. But I thought I would just show you me brushing it out. Good morning, Saturday, 9.37. It's hairspray. And then comb. It is quite soon to be brushing them out, but I'd l I want them to be able to drop out themselves, so I won't do any more than that. I think it still looks okay. I don't like too heavy curls, I like it to be like loose b -shay. Let's put some more hairspray on. Okay, I'll show you my fit. This is the fit. You're a bit bent. There we go. I don't know what shoe you should get. I think you just converse. So this is the jacket. It's going to be a bit chilly. So I might put, uh, take a jumper with me to put underneath. 
But I'm thinking, let me get my Apple Watch on. Put on my DHK Chanel and some Sunnies. What do we think? And then some just white shoes. Do we like the fit? I'll catch up with you in the car. Guys, I'm on the phone, but we've made it into Brum and we're just going to the train station. Um, I just got down to try and get a couple of bits from it. Woo! Um, but yeah, this is the fit for today. This is Dan's fit. He looks oh, he's he looks really cool. I styled him this morning. Um, underneath he's got his Kanye jumper on that I bought him. Oh, I was gifted it actually. I didn't buy him that one. Um, I was gifted that one, wasn't I? From, from ages ago. Um, yeah, and then we're just going to go and hop on the train. We're going to get a start for breakfast and we're going to Houston. Back then to the Arsenal. Fun times. I'll get as many clips as I can, but be a little awkward know, but then people aren't used to being on camera. So I'll do my best. But yeah, see you in a bit. We're in Starbucks. It looks so dark with these sunglasses on. I do a lot of work out that way, now, so I drive yeah. past their house Puffin? a lot. Yeah. Okay guys, we've just got to the Arsenal. Here's Adrian. My dad does exist. There he is. Um, we've just got to the Arsenal and we're just going to choose what we want for food. Um, he's not used to the vlogging life. Here's Daniel. I think I might have... Is it halibut, the feet? Uh, it is. What's the mug? This is the truck, oh, guys. Is it? Yeah, I'm not sure what. There's the choice. I'll let you know what I choose. guys it's currently let me check my watch it's currently half past seven we are back from the game and we're just in the we we're meant to be on the train half an hour ago but it got cancelled they've all got cancelled look at the array of humans waiting uh, we're just in the lounge and we just, oh we just had some snacks and we had this cookie dough mini egg cookie dough and it was unreal um dan's been extremely annoying as usual i can't be annoying i don't think i've done anything wrong. shut up shut dan's up. drunk and annoying so is my dad and they're pissing us off um so yeah story of our lives and i don't know when we got on the train i was hoping for a nice drink but there was this in the fridge it's called two birds but tastes like toothpaste man not a vibe so yeah how did the arsenal gang go for you oh, i don't i don't want to talk about it bad vibes bad result hey Still, Why still, do you look so happy about it? I just, I like to see you in pain. <laughs> it's still an open wound, wound for them. <laughs> this will be an open wound a week. No. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to see where we are. Yeah. Hi, mum. Yeah, it's booth one. Anyway, I look booth like a psychopath, so I'll see you later. the vlog and have a little catch up with you I'm just gonna put my eye drops in so did I even tell you about my optician's appointment if I did I'll just cut this out but basically I'm still using this mega shade thing and I'm do you know what although it doesn't look it my skin is the clearest it's been. I have no new spots this morning. <sighs> Positive vibes. Please let my skin be clearing up. Everybody, come on, let's manifest together. Clear skin. Clear skin. 
mm, mm, clear skin so yeah my skin is actually there's no new spots which is like a rarity and it just looks calm i hope this doesn't jinx it but it looks calm and my skin never looks calm oh um so yeah i went to the opticians on friday and they're basically spec savers in somerset had gave me the wrong sh appointment thing wrong prescription and um they basically been making my eyes work really hard because they've been um, i've got good sight don't get me wrong but they basically had been putting it for um that i'd had but i'd have bad like i couldn't see far away very well but it's the complete opposite i'm having trouble like when i'm like working on a screen that it's like straining my eyes you know so they give me the wrong and so making my eyes really work harder so they've actually now my eyes have um got really dry from like because i'm not blinking enough and stuff so which is quite annoying i'm just putting my cuticle oil on um yeah so i've had to pay 150 pound for new frames which has pissed me off a little bit because i just think i can't i can't afford to be spending that but i don't want to who wants to spend i'd rather spend 150 pound in primark not on fucking things that i paid 250 quid for last year with my calvin klein glasses now i've had to pay for completely new frames which is just annoying right my eyebrows look so good now they just look like naturally good and then i've booked in with the girl for hd brows and it was really weird because i booked a hair appointment um like last month when i got paid and um and i like booked it fine and then i knew it was at the same salon but i didn't think much of it and then I've, I've ended up booking it all for the same day so i'm going to be there like all afternoon um i feel like it's quite boring actually isn't it me I shut up um so yeah that's the, i've only got six minutes footage so i need to hurry up but that was friday I went for a pedicure my little toesies they're like nice and pink they kind of match they don't really match any but we'll go with the five pinks um redid my tan and you know what it's so dark and i love it i love a dark tan and then i wasn't gonna put any makeup on today but we're going for a carvery work on a draw a breath Whew. so i'm gonna just put some light makeup on i'm literally gonna put some max strobe cream and some max strobe cream some charlotte Tilbury flawless filter bit of concealer under the eyes and nothing else i'm just gonna go as natural as makeup can go hey and maybe a little bit of bronzer just to blend the neck in um, but I really want the Charlotte Tilbury beautiful skin. Really, really want it. Um, yesterday, I obviously went to the football. It was a nice day. I didn't get back to all legs. The trains were all getting cancelled. Um, so, yeah, but my dad and Dan get really drunk and irritating. And last time, I, I luckily, I'm glad I didn't see the lovely girl, but she saw me. And she was like, oh, my God, I think I just saw you in Euston Station. You were shouting at your dad. I thought, I said to them, I said, you embarrass me today. And that's it because i don't normally shout guys you know i'm not a horrible person however when you've got two drunk annoying little pigs around you you've got no choice not to shout i tell you you've got to control the children so yes no shouting comments yesterday and we were, luckily we were in first class lounge yesterday so nobody would have been there to hear my shout if there wasn't any um but they weren't too bad they're were annoying i did tell Dan to just write it in a little bit but when you're not drunk and people are around you drunk you're fucking annoying um we can hear Dan cleaning, that's what we like. That's the sound that we enjoy. I can hear the dustpan and brush. That's my boy. Um yeah, we're gonna go for a carver, we're gonna go and take Rory a nice big walk. Um and then hopefully maybe go to the gym later. I'm really feeling it. I feel like my energy's really come back and I'm feeling good. Feeling good. This is what we like. Um I feel like I feel good vibes today, you know. Um, didn't get up till like 10 which was nice but i woke up at like half eight then i went back to sleep um and yeah i've just put up a pretty little thing haul so if you haven't seen that gone gone jigging out um of course they have 25 percent off i ordered another pot haul because i saw some good bits because i really like the structure contour range and jed was like 25 percent off i was like yeah i've already ordered didn't get 25 percent off i did get 20 but a little helps um i used this new mascara yesterday from i'm trying to cram all my information i've got three minutes left now this new mascara false lash queen ps dramatic quite liked it i don't think you'll be able to it'll focus my camera's gone shit but there's the box looks a bit like uh is it too faced 
I don't know which box. Um, but yeah, what else have I got to update on? Nothing really. My new vlog will be starting tomorrow anyway. Um, and I'm going to try and get this up for Monday or Tuesday. Um, so yeah, I am... Um, all good vibes here. All good vibes. Hopefully my skin stays clear. Positive vibes only. And at least I'll just match my... That's the only thing we've not... We've had an acne. I can't put... Well, I could put a fact on my face, but I don't because it makes it look so red. I put my odd, like, I've got a central face serum that I absolutely love. I do put that on sometimes if I'm feeling brave, but it just makes them so red. I feel like sometimes it breaks them out more, but other times I just think it, like, makes them look my acne worse because it looks so red. Um, but I'm literally just going to put that on so I'm, like, a bit more of an even colour. Um... I've really been enjoying this L'Oreal serum, that, that eye serum I showed you in the last vlog. I think I'd definitely rebuy it. I feel like it's very cooling. Revitalift filler and hyaluronic acid. Really enjoying that. This is the bottle. Um, so I would definitely recommend, because I like an eye serum. I feel like sometimes when you get a good one, you can you can tell. Whereas like when you just buy like any and you're not seeing a difference, I feel like they're the ones that are kind of rubbish. Um... Um, the Dyson Hair Wrap Curls didn't, oh god I look crazy, they lasted alright you know guys, like, this is the the fake Dyson Hair Wrap Curls a day later, and I did put hairspray in, but apart from that, what do we think? Oh, my hair got so lovely yesterday, like, war, it's the thing walking around with it down, I feel like, and it's windy and stuff, my hair looks mad today. I feel like I'll definitely use it again. People have been commenting on my TikTok saying it's, it blows up. So that's a bit worrying. My camera is literally going to run out. So I hope you enjoyed the weekly vlog and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!